This is trying to reconnect. There it goes, we're on. Okay, we're on. Here we are. Hello, everybody. Happy Monday. Happy Monday. The blessed day off of all <laughs> us hairdressers everywhere. Well, mostly everywhere. Us old school ones anyway. Al Sigro here. So glad to be here on behalf of Salon Centric and Dennis Bernard Power Tools and Smart Solutions. We, uh, if you saw the header, it says Refresh and Express or Express and Refresh. One or the other. I tried to make it rhyme. The reason I put it like that is what we're going to do today is we're going to show you how to take that three, four, five, six week client, you know, the touch up client, the real faithful one, the core of your business, how to take that client and just with a little flick of the wrist, maintain their color, what they like, but just, you know, sometimes they just want to, I want to change it up a little bit. I just want to do a little something. And we, we're, I'll show you a couple techniques in using some other products to um, convey that feeling to them, plus get them in and out of the salon right away. We're dealing with working people here. We deal with a lot of professionals all day long. And they need to get in, they need to get out. Sometimes it's a lunch break, they just need to get in, get in and get out. We're gonna show you how to get there as quickly as possible and as effectively as possible. So without further ado, um, this is Lynn. And Lynn is, we're going to be doing a series of highlights on here. I'm going to tell you what it's called in a second. This is Deb. She's our, oh, she's our fave. We love the great coverage people. <laughs> we, this is our, this is the core of our business. We, we take care of that lickety split. All right. Now, before we start, plus we have one added extra bonus surprise today. We have a surprise guest with a surprise service. It's going to be awesome. Stay tuned. Come on back and let me show you how we're going to get it done. We're going to be doing a series of highlights and lowlights in here. And where are we at, Michelle? Okay, so we have our, we have our lightener, mm -hmm. and we have our, our low light. Now, to supercharge this and get it done quickly, Michelle's gonna add 13. the TCA, the color accelerator from Power Tools. TCA, the color accelerator, it takes your 45 minutes, your 30 minutes processing time, and turns it into 10 to 15 minutes. 10 to 15, can you imagine 10 to 15 minutes being out? It's amazing, right? Woo -woo. I got a woohoo from the crowd. <laughs> All right, from Dennis Bernard Power Tools. We're gonna to show you the entire Power Tools line here, how we get down with it. We don't go anywhere without Power Tools. Uh, further ado, Michelle, how many are you putting in there, Michelle? I'm gonna do 13 drops. 13 drops, uh, depending on how much your formula you have, it will tell you on the back of the bottle how many drops to put in your formula. Okay, and how about you gonna go there too, Michelle? Yep. yep, and we're gonna go with the low light too. How many are you putting in there? I'm gonna go seven. Seven, seven sounds like a great, I lucky sevens. You gotta love the sevens. <laughs> All right, anything else you're gonna put in there? I, ah. Ah, let's get down. You know, everybody's got a bond, everybody's got a plex. Dennis Bernard Company has the four bonding plex complex. This is the multiplier. It's gonna strengthen your bonds. Very easy to use. It's all pre-made, you're gonna throw it right in there. The great thing about four bond, it does not lengthen your time. You don't have to adjust your, per, your uh, peroxide levels or anything. You just add it in, it does the rest of the work. It can't get any simpler. Part two of this is simply a spray and leave-in conditioner. That's all you gotta do. It's not this extra time, it's gonna take you like an extra half hour, 45 minutes. It's in, it's out. We don't go anywhere. We never highlight without. Four bond. We never highlight without four bond. Always, 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 always in every every formulation we use. It is mind blowing. I'm talking 30 volume. 30 volume. Uh, we use with this no problem. No problem. The hair is always, always fabulous. Okay, Michelle's off. I'm gonna get into what she's doing in a second. Now over here we have our great coverage. So Vince is coming in. Vince had. We're going to do a, a level seven with a, with a gold base. Vince has his product. He's once. Vince is going in with. TCA, color accelerator, baby. Get it done today <laughs> with TCA. That's right. Get it done today. And how about Vince? Uh, 12, 13, 14, here he goes. 15, 16, 17. 17, 17 drops. It's in there. How about it? Now we're going to bail. We're, you have the GOD. You got to have gray oxidizing drops, the GOD, for those tough grays. Stuff works every single time. Every single time. You got tough gray, there's where you want to go with the GOD. Everything goes right with God. Every time. Put a little extra in there. Put a little extra in there. Deb needs all the help she can get this morning. And you know what? Deb's a little sensitive. So we're going to put in from Power Tools STB. Stop the burn. It's got a little peppermint smell to it. And you know, sometimes get extra tingly and stuff. 
So, oh, how's this? Nice. Just peppermint. in time for the holiday season. Just in time. You know, it's going to be like a big peppermint stick in here for old St. Nick. You know that great Andy Williams song, right? I know. Okay, we got, we got. Good to go. He's going to whip it up, whip it up, whip it up. Look, look at the whipping motion. Check out the whipping motion. Oh, yeah. Small little oh, circle. Oh, yeah. Just like you're baking a cake. It's like baking a cake. Bacon. Right on. Look at those grays. I don't know, Vince. You sure you're going to be able to get through those grays? I got this, You got that, Vince? I got, I I got money grays. on it that you're going to get through these Check grays. it out, man. Vince, I got hey, Vince, what are you doing? Dude, I'm trying, I'm trying to chisel out these grays, man. They're so tough. Vince, that's so old school using tools like that. Oh, come on, forget the hand tools. What should I use? Give me those. You got to get yourself some power tools. The TRA power tools, the resistant assistant. There you go, right there. It's basically hydrolyzed ammonia. So we're going to spray it on that on those grays and soften them to receive the color. So watch Vince as he expertly Yay. applies. Can you close your eyes for me real quick? Yes, definitely close your eyes, Deb. Close, that's right, close the eyes. Watch as he expertly applies the TRA. It doesn't get any more simpler than this gang. Do it away from the face, always. Away from the face, so easy a child could Small, do it. But, just sections like that. But don't let a child do it. <laughs> All right, we got that going on there. Okay, Lex, you're gonna spin around here. I wanna show you what Michelle's doing. Michelle's doing a technique called a fanfare technique. This um, is. Somebody asked, what is the stuff that put um, to help coverage, coverage grays? Coverage grays, yep. we put the, let me show you what we did. We did two products. We used the G.O.D., the gray oxidizing drops. Goes right in the color. Goes right into the color. You take it and you drop 20 drops right into the color. Of 20 drops, is it, Vince? 17 to 20. 17 to 20. The directions are right on the back, depending on how much you're using. Around the back there, you add that to your color. And then also, we're spraying in the resistant assistant, the TRA, the hydrolyzed ammonia, to pre-soften those gray hairs. When Vince gets in there, we have total And you want to make sure that they always close their eyes before you put this in, because you don't want to get any of this in their eyes. That's right. None of that in their eyes. Okay, let's go back to what Michelle's doing. So Michelle's laying these foils in, and she's doing them diagonally. They're all going diagonally above and below the parietal bone. Well, she's below the occipital here, but now she's right along the parietal bone all the way around. When they go in diagonally like this, they, they cover a little more area and they're a little bit more subtle. You don't really see the origin of insertion. You don't see where the, uh, the blonde begins or ends because it's, it's instead, of being or instead of being horizontal, they're coming in diagonal. So we get a lot more, left, a lot more use out of it. And- A lot more natural look. A lot more natural look. Thank you, Michelle. That's what I was trying to say. Somebody uh, just asked, do you let the TCA dry before applying color? The TRA dry? No, you go right in. You go right in. Like Vince is going to do right. He's See, working look, it look through. Look at this right here. I'm just working it through. I'm sorry. Jenna asked. Oh, Jenna asked. Cool. <laughs> Thanks, Jenna. Right on. What do you got there, Vince? I'm just, I'm just saying you just mix it all. Make sure all the TRA is all good in there. Mm -hmm. All right. Oh, that's, that's, that's not And Jenna this. asked, will this dry their hair out? Negative. Will Negative. definitely not dry their hair out. But before Vince even goes in, I'm going to do one more thing, gang. Yeah, I know, right? Oh, Let's not that. forget this, That's man, because this one's going back to work after this. We can't have any unsightly stuff going on. This is also from Power Tools, the color stain remover. Not only good for removing stains, but we like to use it as a barrier. Now, even though it's, it might get on some of the gray hair, it will not prevent penetration of color. It will go right through. So very easily, I'm just going to come along. And obviously, even if you're down like level threes and fours, you might want to go a bit heavier. But you definitely want to get that in there right along the hairline, over the ears, under the neck. You know, she's got to go back to work. We're trying to sneak her in there. We don't want to see any like un unsightly bands of color around her face line or anything. I could just stay here all day. Well, that's what I'm talking about. <laughs> that sounds like a great idea. We have a little bit of fun here, not much. And that's what you got to do, okay? P uh, TCS. Particularly with the dark browns, you gotta have it. And you're in your really red, your vibrant reds. Go with this guy. Gotta have it. Gotta have it. Okay. So everybody's off and running. Get rid of this thing. And you can see the application. You can see Vince's application. He's going right over the TRA. No problem there. And then we're gonna be going into a series of foils then. Afterwards. Okay. Very very good. Michelle's doing her thing. Now. Something muy especial. 
Colors, colors, colors. I got something for the fellas though, gang. Got something for the fellas. It's gonna be really, really super. I would like to introduce one of Lancaster's quasi-celebrities in some circles, but if, if you're in Lancaster, you probably know this guy. Mike Shelley! Come on in, Mike! Woo! Woo! Come on in, Mike! Hey, there he is! Woo! How you doing, brother? Hey, brother. Right on, right on. Have a seat, my brother. <clears throat> yeah. Mike's uh, retired from the USPS, and he's watching those guys go bananas around the holiday season. I brought Mike in because I want to show you I want to show you a little thing we do to help the fellas out. You know they're all wearing the hair real tight on the sides, but they're all going for the big pump of door. The higher the better. You know what I say? The bigger the hair, the closer to God. Anyway, <laughs> I, I think I think that was Bridges of Madison County. I'm not sure. It was some of those movies. Anyway, I'm going to show you a really, really cool, dare I say it, perm technique. That's right, I said it. Perm. I know. That, that word that nobody knows about anymore. Really, really cool perm technique. But specifically for the guys. And it's it's a really, really, it's a pretty cool tech. Pretty cool technique. If you can highlight, you can do this, you can do this rap. It's very, very cool. It's nothing new, believe me. We did it back in the Stone Age, like 28 years ago when I got started in this groove. Am I going forward a little bit? Okay, first I'm gonna prep Mike's hair. Here we go, going down. I'm going to slide right in. Mike's a big guy. He fits in there nicely. So I'm going to prep Mike's hair. And we're going to prep using from Dennis Bernard's Smart Solutions. We're going to be using the Clarifying and Demineralizing Shampoo. I like a really clean palette when I'm going in and perming, particularly when I'm perming. I like it clean, baby. I don't have anything residual in there. So. Get in there with my clarifying demineralizing shampoo. I just used entirely too much there. The nice thing about, that I like personally, about Smart Solutions clarifying shampoo is that it doesn't leave the hair tacky. Sometimes a lot of cleansing shampoos, deep cleansing shampoos, they just rough up the hair and, you know, then you gotta put a conditioner in it, you gotta do all the stuff. But no, it comes out, it's, it's smooth, silky, and I can just comb right through it. I don't have to break it down or anything. All right, so I'm getting a nice little lather going on. Don't want to beat them up too much. And this is a really, really, it's a pretty cool wrap we do here. It's a very, very cool wrap. You know, Al, I'll give you an hour to knock that off. You got enough, really? <laughs> <laughs> so Mike's Facebooking, we're Facebooking, Salon Centric's Facebooking. This is kind of like that movie, what's that movie, Vince? Inception. Inception, <laughs> it's kind of like Inception, isn't it? What a ride. Don't be falling asleep, Mike. We don't need to hear the snoring. No. <laughs> I'm sure you don't do that. Oh, believe me, you would. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Let's get this started. We're going to have a good time in here. So behind the camera today is Miss Alexis. There she is. <laughs> <laughs> She's doing a great job. I just kind of threw her into this thing today. But it's going to be a real good time. Now, if we didn't notice, let me introduce some of the players here. Michelle over there. That's actually Mrs. Seagro. That's my wife, Michelle. She's Hi, guys. Oh, hello. Hello. Uh, <laughs> and that uh, handsome bearded devil right over there, that's actually my 26-year-old son, Vincent Seagro. Uh, <laughs> so you are in, you are truly in a family business. I think my dad's going to pop in a little later. You can meet him. So my dad's the third generation. I'm the fourth generation. Michelle's four and a half generations because, you know, she married into the family. And uh, Vince is actually five generations. The shop was actually created in 1868 as a four-man barber chair by my great-grandfather, all here in Lancaster. And then my grandfather took it over in 1919. My dad took it over in the you know, late 70s, early 80s. And then just recently, three years ago, Michelle and I came in and are running the show. So it truly is a multi-generational family, and we have a lot of fun, I'll tell you what. We have a lot, a lot of fun here, a lot of laughs. No drama, a lot of fun. You know, you know I have a question for you. Uh, go ahead, question. Kimberly says, can you get the um, clarifying shampoo at Salon Centrix? Uh, uh, I'm not sure if they carried it yet. I'm hoping it's coming soon. I'm not sure if it's there yet. I know they have the incredible holding spray and they have the flexible holding spray, so hopefully they're gonna get a few more of the products in some time. I would think anyway. All right, brother, now. 
Look who's ringing. Is that you, Vince? Yeah. We're busy. We're busy over here. Maybe somebody sees you online. I bet that's it. What are you doing? What are you doing? He's actually reaching. He's so rude, isn't he? He's reaching in his pocket and grabbing the phone. I'm, bu I'm busy right now. Goodbye. <laughs> okay, Goodbye. Who's that? I have no idea. Okay. <laughs> Is that somebody trying to sell you car insurance? Oh. Okay. Or student loans. Or student loans. Or student loan forgiveness. Or student loan forgiveness. Yes. My son's actually, uh, when he's out, he is, a, he is licensed in the Commonwealth of Pennsylvania as a stylist, but he's also in college right now on the dean's list, yeah. studying all yeah. things chemistry. Go figure. Holla, holla. Uh -oh. So look at that. A chemist that does hair. I'm telling you. I might have seen it all. What an age we live in. But, <laughs> Now Mike does have some gray, so I am going. I'm going to bypass the chisel and the hammer, and I'm going to break out TRA, the resistant assistant. Again, great for perms too. You know, you have some people with the gray hairs, and some is tough, and some isn't. And I'm just going to go in and spray just like that. Just work it in. This works really good. You know, um, my grandmother, God bless her, she's 95 years old. I give her the greatest perm ever. She. Does so well when I put TRA in her hair. It's it's just mind blowing how well it works. Okay, so I'm gonna get my squirt bottle. I'll be right back. Don't go anywhere. Oh. <laughs> Mac, did you miss me? Always. That's right. I gotta steal somebody's comb. Okay, I'm not prepared. My bad. <laughs> Stole a comb. Okay, so check this out, gang. This is so cool. Weave wrap. This is called the weave wrap. This I'm taking you back a few years. A few years back. Back. Here we go. Can I jump in here for one second? Yeah, jump in, Michelle. What do you got? Um, as you have explained, I'm doing a fanfare foil here. And one of the techniques that I have come about in doing the fanfare is when I run the top, I do it on a diagonal. That way when it grows out, it's a lot more natural and you don't see so much tree growth. That, I'm yes. so glad you said that. Thank you for bringing that up. And that is true. You just get so much more life out because you do not see the regrowth. Now, I just laid one of these in. I just laid one in, but I'll show you how I did it. No big deal. This is so cool. Mike, was like, did you get a perm back in the 70s, Mike? I mean, I, well, I did, actually. Yeah, it was real kind of like... you may have done it. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so here's, here I am. I'm going to weave out some hair. Okay, that's all I'm doing. That hair is going to weave out. That hair drops. This hair goes into the rod. So what's happening is some of the hair is going to be wavy, some's going to be straight, and the wavy hair is going to pick up the straight hair. So I really don't have a curl. I have truly, I have truly body in this hair. And it's just a really nice way to go through some of the guys. That, you know, I need a little lift in my hair, Al. And it just works wonders. It does a great, great, great job. Okay, here we go. And I'm gonna get my very expensive perm tool here. It just looks like it just looks like a coffee stir, but it's a very, 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 very uh, expensive perm tool. And I got I like to put these in between the band and the rods to keep the band off the hair so it doesn't get I don't get that line of breakage that can happen so many times. And this is great. Mike's hair is just as it's absolutely perfect for the purple rod here that we're doing. It's only gonna be about, you know, five or six rods. This is very, very simple service. And you know, a lot of the guys, they want the hair, they want the hair big, they want to pop it off the head. So this is a great way. Well, you know why my hair is perfect, don't you? Oh, I, why is that, Mike? Well, because I gotta cut it, uh, the hair port, by, that, you, by you, my friend. That is right, <laughs> I couldn't have said that one better. I'm just glad you said it. Lord knows I have enough ego for everybody in here. <laughs> it wouldn't be unusual for me to say that, that's for sure. Here's another trick y'all can do. Uh, instead of taking a straight parting, take a zigzag parting. This way you never see the, where, the line, where the, uh, the, the perm line is. That's a, that's a really cool trick right there, too. So many tricks. You know, perming's coming back, I got to tell you. I post on a couple uh, Facebook forums, industry forums. Uh, my favorite one being wrong side of the Atlantic. So that was kind of really kind of UK... Uh, Western Europe um, centered, and they're perming like crazy people over there. And you know, if it's happening in Europe, it's going to be happening here real soon. Now, I do a lot of perms, and it's not on 80-year-old women either. It's on 14-year-old um, teenagers. 
They like they like that natural curl. The natural looking curl. I think you look at the channel like the Disney Channel or something where the live action is. All the young ladies are all wearing curly hair. And last time I checked, it seems to be the young ones, the 14, 15 year olds that make the uh, make the fashion moves before everybody else catches on. Okay, that looks good right there. That's it's getting better as we go along here, Michael. You know, funny thing is, there's a lot of 62 year old guys doing the same thing. <laughs> Watch a Disney? I just, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that too. That too, sure. That's great. What spray are you using on his hair? Oh, that's just water, sweetheart. <laughs> that's just water. <clears throat> that's from Gina. Yeah. Okay. Thanks for joining. Again, put one more in here. I'm gonna leave a widow's peak out, and we'll come in with one more. That's it, just like that, just like that. All right, super, that's looking good. So Michelle's getting ready to rock and roll over there. She's just moving and grooving. That's what I do, move and groove. Move and groove. Get them in, get them out. People gotta get to work. All right, that looks good right there. It's gonna be the last rod in. Band stays, that's good. Expensive perm tool. And that's it. That's it. That's it, right? There you go. The hair just put the hair over like that. We're gonna get Mike all wrapped up. We'll apply our lotions. Oh, put sorry. a cap over that. I gotta go downtown for a minute. And nobody will look different, Mike. <laughs> They'll fit right in. <laughs> <laughs> it is Monday downtown. A whole bunch of interesting people walking around. Just saying. Just saying. Okay. So now, oh, and there we go. I'm running up to Walmart. <laughs> <laughs> hey, I'm, no, I'm just saying, you know, I'm, just, I'm not profiling here, I'm just saying. Or Target, which is the upscale Walmart, right? Yeah, yeah. yeah that's what I thought, yeah, exactly. That's Target, isn't it? It says Target, it's like Jacques Penny, so there you go. Oh, somebody will get us for that one. Okay, so I'll get my perm solution ready here. Be rocking and rolling, I got my scissors over here. Sandra asked, um, I joined late. Why are you leaving hair out between the rods? Okay, Sandra, great question. Let me recap. What I'm doing is it's called a weave wrap. It's strictly just for body. I'm not looking for a curl. I'm looking for body. So my men, my men, you know, they're looking for the, the high end tights and the tight on the side and, and kind of pop a door shut top. So um, just like just like a highlight, some of the hair is going to have a bend, some won't. But the bendy hair is going to pick up the straight hair to give me that height. This is a great service for the guys. It doesn't look like you got a perm. Looks really, really cool. Take it when they blow it out. You just get a ton of volume. Comes out really, really good. I like to put an extra big hole in my bottle, by the way. That's just preference. And just easily going to lay it in. No big deal. Nice and easy lemon squeezing. What brand of perm? I, I would love to share that with you, but at this point, I can't right now. It is an acid wave, though, I'll tell you that, okay? It's a secret formula. I imported it from France. Just kidding. <laughs> it was from Italy. Just kidding. All right, and that's all I'm going to do there. And then I'm going to make Mike look really, really... Oh, this is going to look good here. Where'd my little bag go? Where did my bag go? Huh. I hope, I hope all my friends at Valentiners are tuning in. <laughs> to... Oh, wait a minute, Mike. Wait till I do this. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. 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 There we go. Now they're... Do you recommend this on longer hair to skip? Absolutely. Okay. I've done that many, many times. Many times. You get a big, a nice big teal rod. Absolutely. Michelle, is your phone around? I'm going to do a timer. Uh, right there. Right there it is. Okay, cool. No, long hair, it works great on long hair. Any length hair, it works absolutely dynamite. Absolutely dynamite. Also, Gina asked, would you do this on women also if they don't want much curl? Absolutely. Or could you? Absolutely. No doubt. Comes out beautifully. It's a great way to give a perm without giving a perm. Just get that, let's get that stuff going. All right, now I'm going to pop Mike under the jar for 10 fun filled, fabulous minutes. <laughs> and I'm going to back there. No, you stay right there, Mike. Right there. I'll be right there. Minutes are right behind you, buddy. Yep, no problem. Okay. Get this going. I'm going to pop Mike under, then I'm going to, I'm going to jump in with Vince a little bit here. And I'll show you. A cool baby-like technique around Deb's head. Just switching things up a little bit. 
You know we gotta do that before that though. Oh, I know, right? TCS, son. <laughs> TCS. Well, I might, well, just, I might be a little tall for this. Hang on a second. Jeepers. No, we height requirements today. <laughs> oh, yes. Send Alvin out to the guy that bows. Okay. <laughs> and you're good, my brother. All right, time away. Let's get over here with Vince. Just put my gloves. Here oh, that's go. perfect. You like that? <laughs> yeah. yeah, the guys will want to see this. Cool. Yeah. <laughs> no, no, no one wants to see this. They're just going to be jealous, Mike. Oh, no. The haters got to hate. Hate, hate, hate. Real hate, men. Hate. Real, Real men. men. Real men. That's right. <laughs> Way too much fun. And hey, gang, you know, this is really nothing special. We rock like this every single day of the week. Every day that we have a lot of laughs too. We have a ton of laughs. Vince, I'll be right back. All right, sounds good. Okay. So what I'm doing, I'm just getting all the excess color on the skin up so it doesn't stain later on after the process. Hey, for all my Facebook peeps, this is uh, Seagrove's Airport on Queen Street. What's the address here, Michelle? So anyway, I'm using TCS <laughs> on this to get rid of the excess color so once we get done processing, we don't get that stain afterwards, and, which can be hard to get up sometimes. So. As, as Al said, it doesn't affect the color in any way whatsoever. You know, it's entirely safe. I, I Just get all this stuff. Back in the 80s, I think it was. Seriously. And, uh, Just like and then, of that. Course, Bam -bam. Change my hair style. Really sure. Now I'm gonna get her parted so for highlights in the meantime. Because so, me and I didn't really pops need a hair jumping in. But uh we're here for all your needs. Jump in, jump in. Yes, yeah, you, you guys are incredible. Okay, Lex, bring it on over here, baby. And here we go once again. Getting my lightener ready. This is for my friend Mark. TCA. I'm going in with 20 drops. Here we go. One, two, oh, three, here. four, five, six, yeah. seven, eight, Joel, nine, Joel, ten, eleven, Joel, twelve, Joel, thirteen, Joel, fourteen, fifteen, yeah. sixteen, yeah. seventeen, yeah. eighteen, yeah. nineteen, twenty, fire! You're in. Gotta have it, gotta love it. I don't go anywhere. I don't go anywhere with highlighter unless I'm using molecular bonding complex. Four bond. For sure. With four bond. There's a little space in here that tells me exactly where to go. Boom, there it is. Whip, 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 whip it up. Whip, whip, whip it up. Just like that. Okay, let's get her going. Nice consistency, looking good. About ready there, V? v, v? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Stay up far enough, far enough. Okay, can I get a low light, please? Yeah, what do you want? Um, want something warm. Now, this is something we do at Sigros a lot. We work like a team here. There's only one diva, that'd be me. I'm more of a heva. But anyway. <laughs> Wait a minute, no help from the peanut gallery. Anyway, <laughs> we're gonna go in and we do this all the time. Someone takes the front, someone takes the back. This is gonna start in the back here. We're gonna initiate some highlights and lowlights. Yeah. You might wanna slow down just a little bit, Vince, because we're waiting, waiting for the low light to come in. Now, gang, I wanna show you something. The pattern we don't. Um, you're gonna do one, one to one until oh, yeah, you have one a one bone. Okay. Gotcha. So, check this out. Here's a really cool little baby like technique. Hey, Deb. Yep. You're part of the, you're part of the team here, ready? Handy's <laughs> Vince and I in the general area where we're working. I can hear you got that, right? You can hear I mean I am on it. Okay, so here we go, some baby lights. I'm gonna start this one. He's gonna be horizontal. Now we got two hands coming at me at once. That's right. <laughs> That's how we work. Okay, and I'm gonna sandwich foil. I'm not really into the old origami thing. I'm gonna sandwich foil. Origami. Yeah, the origami thing. I don't know, it kinda of bugs me. And now this one. I'm gonna come in from here. Okay, so now I got a little angle going on. Got me? And a little angle, just like that. Okay, just like that, a little angle. And now I'm gonna come in Straight again, horizontal. Just like that. 
Three little tiny baby lights. Go a long, long way. I'm gonna come the other way now. Oh, yeah. Go right up. Oh, that's right. So I got one, this one, one, that one. That's where I'm going that, that way. And just going in diagonally, just changing the shape, changing the vibe. Just changing the vibe of the highlight instead of being so rigid. We're adding a little, little fun to it. Like that. I do okay, I'm gonna do one more here. I'm gonna finish that off. Oh. Just like it at. Okay, so there's that right now. Okay. Now I want you all to stick around. Mike's timing is gonna be done here shortly. And I have a nice little trick that we're gonna be doing with him on his neutralizer. Okay. I mean, very, very, very cool stuff we do. I'm going to show you how to get the, the best result out of your perm by using one of these power tool additives actually in the neutralizer. And I mean, it is a game changer, a complete game changer. Does it change the game? It cha yes, it changes the game. I'm kidding, this guy. The game has been changed. Moe Flip. You've got three minutes on mic. Three minutes. Uh, who's available? I guess I'll be available. I'm going to knock this out real quick. Okay. Gonna spin around a little bit there, Bing. All right, here we go. Switch sides. High, high five. Up top. Woo. Here we go. Woo. Come on. <laughs> Teamwork. There's no I, I like and it. team. Just there's, a me. There is a me, though. There's no I and team, but there is a me. <laughs> right on. Here we go. Scalpel. Scalpel. Sponge. Suture. Deb knows. Deb's my neighbor, actually. Mm -hmm. And uh, you know what? I, we, I, I'm the new neighbor. I'm, I, we've been in the new neighborhood uh, pushing two years. And when I, old neighborhood, I was the guy who everybody had to keep up like with. Forever. Thanks a lot, Deb. Okay. <laughs> Back in my old neighborhood, I was the guy you had to keep up with, with the lawn and everything. I was the first to mulch. I was the first to do this. I was always the first to do that. I was like, I'm trimming this. And this girl here is like a dynamo. I come home on Saturday. She is out of control. This girl, I mean, I would be just looking at her makes me sore. She, she's got, she's in the flower bed, she's trimming, has every tool known to man. I have power tools. Power tools. <laughs> you think we got power tools? She's got some serious power tools. Absolutely. Absolutely. She wields, I, like she had the hedge trimmer out the other day, she wields that thing like a samurai warrior. Girl was out of control. But now I gotta keep up with her. My leaf blower on my own hair. <laughs> yeah, but Deb was fortunate. It looked like your yard got all the leaves. I didn't have one on mine. On is, that, is that it? I knew Michelle was doing something. Okay, so we're just moving right along here. And as soon as I finish this, I'm going to go rinse my for a few. And Anna, we got this secret additive we're going to put in his neutralizer. It's going to be mind blowing. I read the yoga this morning. It's quite a stretch. Oh, Vince is full of it this morning. It's my daily yoga. <laughs> Man doing foil. Got it. Okay, that's that one right there. Super. Super duper. All right. Lynn on the other side. Lynn's getting vacation here today. She did get a whole lot of Michelle love. She got a whole lot of loving going on in that head today. And when Lynn's not... She might have to pack me in her suitcase. <laughs> well, Lynn can probably tote you around, Michelle, because Lynn doesn't look like it, but Lynn is actually a... Champion, multiple champion uh, bodybuilder. Although she doesn't look like it, Woo. but she—I'll uh, tell you what. Not muscles. Between her and Deb, Deb's a Deb's a real gym rat. Between the two of these girls, even if there might be seven pounds of, or seven percent of baby of uh, fat between the two of them, maybe. I was hoping to get into a I pose now. So. <laughs> Lynn's doing real well. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Cool. Michael. That's it, and that's how you get that done. Rin, you're on the rest. Here we go. I'm gonna go rinse Whoa. Mike. Yes, sir. I'll give this to Vince. Alright, you good? Super. Alright.
right. All right, all right, all right, all right. Looking good, looking good. Let's put that right there. Now uh, what, um, you have 20 volume? I got, that is, that is 20. Uh, I said it's bumped up a little bit. Okay. Yeah, it's bumped up. It's like a 28. Mix. Uh, it was... Yeah, half and half. Yeah, go for it. One of these days we're gonna give our clients a glossary of terms we use because we, we speak in a code. Some clients actually get it if the code after a while. Okay, Michael's gonna lean forward for me a wee bit. Okay, and back all the way. Here he goes. Get right back in there. Let me set the timer. Okay, seven, here we go. So we're gonna rinse Mike for, for five minutes. And then we have something way especial coming up. Alrighty. Could you be able to answer some questions about uh, the Yes, right I would love to answer some questions. Alright. What do you got? Mm. What is life? Why is there air? Yeah. <laughs> got it, no problem. Um, how come you don't start at the root of the hair? I would start at the root of the hair? Yes. When foiling? Yep. Because it'll bleed right onto the scalp. So what you do, plus what happens is if you're a follower of um follower of chemistry or follower of physics in diffusion molecules in a smaller concentration will always go to an area of lesser concentration so what I'm trying to say is if I put the, if I put it here it's going to by itself creep up okay the, the, the highlighter the lightning form is actually going to creep up it's not going to stay there it's going to creep up and expand so if I stay just a little bit away from the head that lightning will creep up there all by itself. If I put it right on the scalp, it's going to bleed, and I'm going to get leopard spots and an unhappy client. No way, no. How's that? Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Leave a little time. Leave a little, leave a little space for that for the, your lightener to creep and crawl around. It'll do that for you. And trust me, I got that to experience. I've uh, there's there's my, my early years. There were one or two leopard spots hanging around. Debbie asks, are you doing just a frost? Just a frost. Now we're doing a multi-dimensional highlight there. There's going to be highlights and there's going to be low lights. And when we glaze or tone, we're actually going to be using a toner on there too. So it'll be multi-dimensional highlighting and, and low lighting. Um, Bianca asks, what line are you using? What line am I using? The same line I'm using in my perm. I can't talk about that right now. I imported it from some foreign country. <laughs> you know, when you're in the business a while, you get to know people. Just saying, I got a guy. I got a guy. He gets me some stuff. <laughs> Everybody's got a guy, don't they? I got a guy. You got a guy, Mike? You got to have a guy. You got to have a guy. Everybody needs a guy. I've never weaved over color. Is it going to lift the same as the end? Oh, absolutely. Absolutely. It's going to lift like a champ. I've been doing that move for many, many years now. And it'll lift right through, no problem at all. Particularly at the lighter levels. Now, if you're using something like at a, a level four or five, what, what we'll do is we'll use a 30 volume on the uh, where the color is, and then we'll use a 20 volume on the mid strand and ends. Okay. And can ask even on just a highlight, or just because because you have a touch up on. Uh, what was the question again? I'm sorry. Um, even on just a highlight or just because you have touch up on? Oh, no, uh, no, 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 no. Well, depending what the root, the existing root color is, depending on what the existing level is, I might. I might. All depends what's going on. Each, you know, each, each service, everybody's different. What comes in, particularly with somebody new, um, particularly if they told me, yeah, I box color at home, oh, yeah, I'll definitely be, uh, definitely be uh, using higher volumes. A lot of times what I'll do is I'll test strands first. And I got to tell you, you get somebody new in and you don't really know the history of the color that's going on. I real, And they're, they're wanting something, you know, or whatever, lighter or whatever. You don't know what the history. And particularly if they say, I've been coloring at home all my life. Mm, test strand. Do yourself a favor. Save yourself, save yourself a lot of aggravation. Just simply do a test strand. Even if they come in beforehand, um, Go in, maybe just take a little piece of hair out, cut it off, test it in the back, and you know this way you know what's going on. But man, you can't test strands enough anymore. Michelle, how am I doing on time over there? What's I'm two fifty one. Two fifty one. So Mike's got about. Your, just father, got, your father just pulled up. 
Um. Great grandpa's here. Run. Okay, we're done with that. So Dara says, so your highlight was a 30 on the color part, then 20 on the end. Yeah. Seems like you only used one bowl. No, I'm saying sometimes, and not not this particular situation. This particular situation, we did like a 28 volume all the way through. Now, on some heads, don't misunderstand me. On some heads, it's wise to use a wise to use a 30 on the new growth, especially if the new growth is darker. Yeah, particularly if the new growth is like way darker. Particularly if this stuff is way darker. Better use a 30. Good question, though. Purple's your color, Mike. Sorry, we need to clarify that. Thank, thank goodness Vince is here to clarify. <laughs> and why did you put the permanent in the sheet? Because I like to. <laughs> there it is. Yeah. <laughs> that, I guess you would call that, you would call that acquired knowledge. I've been doing this game long enough, and I know how my perm reacts. I know how they take, and I know that for 10 minutes, for what I desire, my levels of desirability, I know that what it says, what it needs, and what it's going to take. And guess what? We do have a celebrity. Where's my dad? Bring him in here. I told you he'd be here sooner or later. <laughs> I got out of therapy. He got out of therapy, so he's all therapized. All right. Well, we talked. We talked a little bit earlier about this multi generational thing we have going on. And right here is my dad, Jack Sigro. Jack, say hello to your adoring fans. Hello, fans. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> no autographs today, please. <laughs> My dad's been a barber for how many years, Jack? Uh, handful. Well, handful. Okay, that's a good answer. <laughs> I see where this conversation's going. <laughs> Trade secrets, no one can tell. You know, my, my, dad, uh, my dad and my mom provided me a great place to uh, get my career started 28 years ago. It'll be 29 years on April 1st. You know, I, I love that April 1st thing. Because when people say, Hairdressing? Who makes a living doing hairdressing? You got, you got to be a bartender or something on the side. Well, fooled them, didn't we? Or a photographer. Oh, oh. <laughs> hi, Jack. Hey, how you doing? Okay, so follow me, Lex. This is the move I want to tell you about. This is it. Here's my neutralizer. Here's my neutralizer. I'm taking five drops of TCA. Yeah, that's right. Not just for color anymore. I'm going to take five drops of TCA. Gonna add it into my neutralizer. Two, three, four, five. Okay. And I'm gonna shake the bejesus out of this stuff. So I really wanted to get in there and mix, okay? And this makes your this satisfies and soothes that violent action of perming that we just did there. Soothes it and makes it feel so much better. The hair is so soft when it's done. It's amazingly soft and shiny. Here. Okay, let's get Mike rewrapped. Oh, and there goes the phone. Another five minutes. Okay. Vacation hair. Vacation hair. She must really be on vacation. <laughs> Way on vacation. Stratospheric vacation. Okay, and I gotta find my scissors again. I keep losing stuff, but here we go. All right. So I got all in there, and this is a game changer. When you add five drops of TCA into your neutralizer, a game changer. Um, yeah, I, I perm, like I said, I perm my grandmother a lot. My uncle, who knows nothing about hair, I mean nothing about hair, and he sees his mother and he says, you know, I don't know anything about hair, but mom's hair always looks so nice and shiny. It's, I don't know what Al does. He, there's nothing like it. That's a little secret right there. It's actually recommended by the company. Dennis does recommend that. I'd like to take, I'd like to take all the uh, accolades on that one, but no, that's Dennis's. Okay, we've got five minutes with that, and that's it. We're done. Right. We're done with that one, and we got some going over here. And Deb's come along really well. I have a question. Yeah, go ahead. What did he use on the perm bands to keep the hair from breaking? I know, right? Look at these things. These are very, very expensive perm tools. They're actually coffee stirrers. I get them at the restaurant store. It's like dollar ninety-eight for a thousand of them. I'm not that original. When I went to school in New Jersey in Mason to Paris, uh, future, what would then be future Neha winner Frank Rosieri sent me, we were doing a competition, sent me down to the coffee shop and says, here, gave me 10 bucks for some, some um, coffee stirs. Went down to the coffee shop with coffee stirs. You know what? I don't feel bad if I lose them. They're $1.98 for a 1,000 of them, so. Coffees, and you can snip them. Like, sometimes I'll snip them in half. Like, if I don't want all that there, I'll take one, you know, and snip it so it fits in better, stuff like that. 
Right. Can it you does. use TCA with matrix perms? You can use it. You can use TCA with anything. It's anything at all. It, 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 it. And the funny thing is, when I was an educator for um, another company, uh, do you want to check one real quick? Uh, when I was an educator for for another company, I won't name. I did insulin education. I didn't even read it. That's how busy I did. I did insulin education. I did platform work. I did editorial work. And every single company said to me, "Don't adulterate our products." Just finish up your time. Don't adulterate our products with any of these additives. Don't do it. We don't guarantee our work. So, come on back. I want to tell you the story, want, by the way. Do you want your dad to say anything? They're, they're gonna... I have a Disney shoot next, so I'm going the, to... The, the, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, is that the Sports Illustrated Men's Edition, right? I have too much makeup to do on makeup. <laughs> All right. Thanks for showing up, Jack. All right. Right on. That lovely blonde in the back, that's my mom. She made it all possible, too. <laughs> She's kind of shy. <laughs> Bye. See you guys. See you, Grandpa. So now that you brought that up, let me tell the story. I'm not, this is one of my favorite stories Hi, to tell. So for years, I'm, I'm in here doing color, and the sales reps would come in. This is when I had, like, regular sales reps. They come in, and they say, oh, you do a lot of color, don't you? I said, yeah, it's my whole business is color. Have you tried TCA, the color accelerator? I said, no, I haven't. Why? Why should I try it? Well, you know, it makes your color come, color come up faster so you make more money. I said, that's great. And I'm a chemical guy. I said, well, how does it work? And he would say, well, you know, you make more money because your color comes up faster. So for years, the sales reps would say this. It didn't mean anything to me. I need to know how it works if I'm going to be putting something in my product. So Michelle and I are at the big show, the Chicago show, the ABS, and we're walking up and down the trade show floor, and there's this cute little blonde there. She's like, hi, have you tried TCA? It makes your color come up faster, so you make more money. And I'm like, tell them, right, Michelle, right? Yeah, it's right? true. Very it's true, true, right? I'm like, that's great. How's it work? I don't know. Does anybody know how it works? I don't, but these guys do. So we go into the booth, and there's Dennis, and there's his brothers, and there's little Joe Fabo, and there's all the guys. And they sit me down. They explain to me how it works, how it slows down the oxidation process, and with, with a mild with a, 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 a mild heat that, that allows the cuticle to open up bigger and the, the color molecule to penetrate further, and it doesn't the, the um, peroxide is not eating up all of your color that you just put in. So Dennis says to me, he says, "Listen, here's what you're going to do. You're going to give me this amount of money. I'm going to give you. You're, you're going to buy one of everything in my Power Tools line. Take it home for two weeks. Try it out." Tell me what you think. I'm like, all right. So I come home, and I mean, Tuesday morning, we're hitting the ground running, and I'm putting the holy cow. I mean, my color was good before, but holy moly, my color was mind-blowing. And instead of waiting 45 minutes or 10 minutes, and I'm out the door. You're kidding me. So I called him up after two weeks, first thing in the morning, and I mean, I used all the products. I just, I, what was my life without these? I have no idea. So then, two weeks later, I call him up at 7 o'clock in the morning. I call up, and... Uh, Call the number and good morning, uh, Dennis Bernard Incorporated. Uh, yeah, hi, my name's El Cidro. Um, uh, I'm at Dennis in Chicago, and I I bought some stuff from him, and and he wanted me to call him and tell him, you know, about how I like the product. Is he in yet? Who the heck do you think's in here at seven o'clock in the morning? How you doing, Alex Dennis? And we just had this great conversation. So then he says, "Okay, I'm glad you like the products, Al. What you're going to do now is you're going to give me this amount of money. I'm going to send you one of everything in my wet line: shampoo, sprays, conditioners, everything. You tell me what you think." So I get my product. Holy moly! First time I use, first time I use it. I mean, it wasn't the prettiest product in the world. The money wasn't in the packaging. The money was in the container. That's where the money was spent. And this stuff was magnificent. Changed everything. I've never had client that I've been exclusive with this product for. Uh, 11 years. 11, 11 years I've been exclusive with this product. Half and half 20 volume? Yeah, go for it. Um, um, actually, bump it up. Bump it up to 30. Oh, snap. Yeah, but... <laughs> On that dirt. Okay. And uh, so I bought it. It's been exclusive. My clients love it. They buy two of everything. Not just one. They buy two of everything. It's just a great dynamite, dynamite product. I've been dying to say that. And thank you for the perfect question Thanks, and the Dennis. opportunity to do it. Thank you. And thank you again, Dennis. I say it all the time. I say it all the time. Um, we have some questions about TCA. Go ahead. Alright. What do you got? Can you use TC on, TCA on gray retouch? <laughs> can Can't you, even talk. That's okay. <laughs> on gray retouch. Absolutely. Put TCA every time you're doing a color. Put the TCA in there. Trust me. Put the TCA in there. Every time you do a color, a little highlight, put the TCA in there. You cannot go wrong. It's going to benefit you. It's going to benefit your client. 
Right. And does the TCA need heat? TCA likes to work with heat. Yeah, it does like, but not necessarily. But it's got, that's what it's designed to work for low heat, not high heat. It's designed to work with low heat to get the process moving along. All right, so do you mix the TCA directly with the neutralizer? Absolutely. Uh, yeah, I put that yeah, right in the neutralizer. I put five drops in the neutralizer and shook the heck out of it. You can see Vincent's doing it right now. He's putting it right in the color, whipping it up into a oh, frenzy. Mm -hmm. He's got the four bond going on. Can you so use it you on a CBC? relaxer? No CBC. What's that, in a relaxer? Yeah. Absolutely, absolutely, TCA and everything. Absolutely, you, you, you can only help. It will only help and soothe. It will not do anything detrimental. Rest. Never, Rest. never, never, never. Never, ever. I think How it's much, like, go ahead. Oops, sorry. How much TCA do you use with the three ounce color? With three ounce? Hold on, hold on. It's on the back of the bottle. This is how easy they make it. Information's right here. Let's see, three ounces. Well, there are two ounces is 13 drops. Four ounces is four ounces. Oh, three ounces. Three ounces, 13 drops. There you go. See? Three ounces. Thir everything's right there. It's so easy. Even I can do it. Okay? Even tells you if you, if you have shortages or remixing, add five drops. It goes very detailed. Easy to read, too. It's not in hieroglyphics. It's very easy to read. Erica asks, how many drops of TCA do you use in color or highlight for perms? Is it always five drops? What is the magic number? Yeah, for perms, it's five drops. No more, no less. I don't screw with that one. Five drops and that's it. And again, with color, just refer to the back of the bottle, how much color you're using, and put the um, recommended drops in, and you're good to go. Well, I'm getting ready to do a glaze over here. Yeah, uh-oh. Okay. I don't know what we're exactly... Uh, we're going to do a, uh, we're going to do uh, some triangles. Got it. Okay. Karen asks, where are you located? And I'm in beautiful Lancaster, Pennsylvania. Doesn't it look like Amish country in here? See, they got that little bit of wave in there. It's perfect. Mm -hmm. Beautiful Lancaster, Pennsylvania, right downtown. Okay. Yeah, let's go triangles. Let's go icy and cream. Got it. Lead with icy. <clears throat> All right. Now, just a simple five-minute rinse here. Um, Go ahead. All right. How much on a relaxer does it have that on what? that on back of a bottle as well? Yep. Everything's on the back of the bottle. Let's go right to the back of the bottle. Plus, when you get the product, when you get the product, it goes into much more detail. There's a little um, pamphlet that comes in, a lot more detail. And Jamie asks, perm, so only in the neutralizer, not in the process. Correct. Solution. Only in the neutralizer. Correct. 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 And it, it is not, I can, I can just feel it. I can feel where the TCA was in this perm. I can just feel it. It's just that beneficial. It's that conditioning, it's that soothing. If you're doing it with the high lift color, do you have to foil faster? No, not at all. <laughs> not at all, because it's, it's not gonna kick in until you put the heat on it. No, not at all. Okay. And does it help cover in gray? It definitely assists in covering gray. Definitely assists in covering gray. And if you use that along with, along with TRA, the resistant assistant, the spray we did, if you go back to the beginning of the video, you'll see us use that, and the GOD, the gray oxidizing drops. You use all that in concert with each other, you will never met a gray hair you can't beat. Are you an educator and will you be at the Long Beach Hair Show in Los Angeles? <laughs> <laughs> I was an educator for a couple of different companies. I will not go into who I was an educator for. I did in salon education. I did regional education. These lovely people sent me all over the nation uh, doing things, uh, teaching classes, doing platform, editorial work. Yes, there was a time when I was an educator. Um, frankly, you know, I just like to share what's going on. I like to share the good things. It, uh, we're all in this industry together. We're all in this together. It's not me against you. We're all together. If I find something that really, really works, I want to share it with everyone. So I want everyone's hair to look good, and I want us to look like geniuses. If you take your, you take your work to the next level, get yourself some power tools, just put them in your existing color, and you can't go wrong. Everything will look great. The only thing you don't use it in is direct dyes, your manic panics, your stuff like that. Only stuff that has, um, yeah, you don't use it in direct dyes. Okay, so your unicorns and stuff like that, uh, unless, you know, you're not going to use them in your direct eyes. That's about the only caveat with that, okay? Where can you get TCA? Probably just go, uh, 
Go to DennisBenard.com and they'll probably clue you in in your area where it is in your area. If your color can't have heat, how does the TCA work? It works fine, it just takes a lot longer. It works just fine, you're, just, you're still gonna get that conditioning benefit, but um, you're just gonna, your time is gonna be, you'll be probably going your regular time. Your 30 minutes or 45 minutes processing. But it will assist in the health of the health level of the hair. And the quality of the color. These are great questions, by the way. Oh, really, really dynamite questions. When you do a perm, why I get, why do I get the grayish color on the dark hair after perm? When you perm, why do you get the grayish color? Could you repeat that, Lex? <laughs> when you do a perm, why I get the grayish color on the dark hair after perm? That one might be a mystery. There you go. One slid by me. I'm gonna be honest with you. I have no idea. <laughs> I might want to look that one up later. Or you know what? There's this thing called Google. If you ask Google, sometimes it'll tell you things. It's not just for crazy cat videos anymore. You know, it's just saying. So how do you judge timing under heat with color? Um, I start. I usually, I, honestly, I, I average usually 15 minutes to get my if I'm if I'm covering gray, 10 to 15 minutes. Just take a look at 10 to 15 minutes. If I'm highlighting like we did with Lynn over here, we want an extra boost. Sure, go a couple extra minutes. But you know, 20 minutes is a heck of a lot better than 60 minutes. And listen, it's less time for the product on the hair. The longer the product's on the hair, the more damage it's doing. You want to get in and you want to get out. That's the key. Jessica asked, what was the other product he added to the lightener after the TCA? That was the <laughs> four bond four, four plex. That was our Dennis's version of a bonding flex, uh, the, uh, the keratin protein multipliers. We use it in all of our lightning service. Anytime there's bleach, we have four bond uh, complex in that bleach. Mm -hmm. Absolutely, we never go anywhere without it. Monica, can you use it while using Oplex too? Two different things. Negative, uh, you would use what, use TCA? I assume. If you're using TCA, absolutely, go get them. Put TCA in everything, except direct dyes. <laughs> All right, Mike, we're just about done. Yeah, we're done. Looking good, looking good. Like I knew you would, like you would. Is there a second step to the bonder? Uh, there is. It's a leave-in treatment. You spray it in, you leave it in, you're done. You don't have to wait around 15 minutes going no, stuff no through the hair. No extra shampoos, no extra conditioning. No extra shampoos, no extra nothing. You bang it in, bang, you're out. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. And look at that, that perfect lift. Just that perfect, perfect body curl going on there. Just wonderful, just enough to get that hair up off the head. Boom. I'm just gonna take Mike out. I'm just gonna blow this out real quick. No big deal. Perfect. Doesn't look like Greg Brady. That's all we need to know. <laughs> That's for sure. That's for sure. Okay, Michelle's gonna show. I'm gonna blow Mike out real, gonna blow Mike's hair out real quick. Mm -hmm. And Michelle, you wanna describe what you're doing there? Uh, I can try. <laughs> <laughs> Hold out, Mike. I'm sectioning Lynn's hair in a series of triangles, and I'm going to take two different toners to them alternate each one of them, and it's going to give a nice, beautiful, uh, what do I want to say? Dimension. Dimension. Thank you. That's the first time. Two beautiful blondes. Nice dimension. So I'm gonna go mix up my color. You can check it out, zoom in if you want. I'll be back. No, it's really good by you having enough oils. Yeah. And you have enough for one row and you have, <laughs> you have enough for everything and none left. Like I've only done that like once or twice. I'm gonna say, you have like enough for the one thing I'll tell you about the way to do this, like once or twice. the way the triangles are, after it's all done, all the color links in together like this. So you don't really see any uh, any any harsh lines of color. They all come together like that. This is an Al Sigro technique, by the way. This is mine. Triangular glazing technique. Mine, 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 mine. I came up with that a few years ago. By the way, did I tell you it's mine? It's mine. Hey, whose is it? Whose is it? This guy. Yeah. All right, get my here. Finishing up right here. And just like I was saying first, you don't put the lightener right up at the top. You start it down, get this here, and you work your way up. You do a little wiggle, do a little wiggle right there. That way, 
No bleeding whatsoever, no leopard spots. Holla holla. I'm short, I know it. I have to stand on my tippy toes sometimes. <laughs> And the best part is with the four bond, no matter how long this lightener has been in, it's not doing any damage to this hair whatsoever. None whatsoever. Go watch Michelle add my boot drops in. Done. I added 13 drops in each bowl of TCA. I also added four bond into each, keep the hair nice and healthy. Michelle, what's the brand that carries four bond? It is through with Dennis Bernard Power Tools. Yeah, question. Yeah, so can I go stick my car in the meter out there? Can you stick your car in the meter? I need another round. We'll do it. It's out in front. I got you. I can do it for you. What kind of car is it? It's the it's the white um, CX5 sure. Mazda down there by the uh, meter. Okay, I got you. I'll do it for you then. No worries. I'm gonna do it right now while you're processing. Another one of our many jobs. Being the you meter. want me to get my card? Nope, I got it. All right. Uh, do, do you already have the little paper slip? Um. Or did you pay it all yet? I paid Bam. two hours worth. Okay. Bam. You know how yeah, they yeah, work in this You head back up yeah, and you can see the final product. Yeah. Two Mike. hours and Enough? then I don't know if I got a little bit. going on over here. Oh, yeah, look at that. Three inches taller. He's three inches tall. He's already six one. He's now coming soon for us. See that? Doesn't even look like a perm. Doesn't look fried. It's nice and shiny. Looks great. Took nothing to get the volume. Figure his airport. So we do it, okay? We wrap for the man in your life. Or the woman in your life. Try to rewrap, because that's where it's at. How about it, Mike? Thank you, Al. I love Mike, it, brother. Pleasure, man. Thanks for coming out. I love it. Thanks for coming out. Right on. Let me get some kids. I'll get you out of here. All right. Right yeah. on. Two hours expired. See you, Michelle. See you, Michael. Very nice. Yeah. Yeah. Very nice. Enjoy. Michelle, what toner levels yep. are you yep. using? Sure using level 10. Using them, something, one is a little more ashy than the other, just to give a nice pop. Oh, great. Thanks. For vacation. All right, let's get you This is what we call the Michelle Love in here going on. <laughs> All right. This one takes to take about 10 minutes. No problem. All right, super. There we go. Mike's not supposed to go anywhere. He's supposed to hang out with us. Nah, he's got to go. He's got to hang some photos. So here we go. We started this an hour ago. We already got a full head in. Um, the, the method we use, we're, we're, we're just sailing through here. Sailing through this. Our maximum times... For typical, you know, retouch, full set of highlights, or if we're doing some designer stuff like this, two hours, maybe two and a half at the very, very longest. We get them in, we get them out. And our clients really appreciate that because they work. They work for a living, you know? Ain't gone all day. 
How much do you charge for the man's partial perm with cut? Partial perm like that, I get 40. I'm in an amount, no problem. Tack a, tack a haircut on top of the 55, 60 total. Whatever the market will charge. How long do you leave the toners on for? These toners are going to stay on for approximately t uh, five minutes. Express. It's going to be on five minutes. This is an express tone. About on five minutes. Boom, boom. Out the door. No heat. Can you guys come to Maryland? <laughs> <laughs> I'll tell you what. We got a lot of clients from Maryland. Come up to Lancaster. Mm -hmm. If uh, you go on Seagrove's Airport, check out my Facebook. Uh, you'll see a lot of videos I do there. And you'll see I, I have, a, I have another, actually a perm. Actually, a pro beautiful, girl, beautiful girl. Um, she came up from Maryland. She get, got here. I think I turned you Put it back on. There you go. She, um, we, got, we were going, it was for her, I think it was for a prom or something, or, or photos or something, but she was supposed to be here at 7 a.m. I pull up, I pull up at 6.40. She's already here. We start pretty early here at Sid Rose. We go, uh, we only work half days, just 12 hours a day, you know, just kidding. <laughs> but um, we start pretty early. Seven o'clock is uh, six thirty. It's not an unusual start for us. We find that people like to get done before work instead of doing it after work. We find that everybody's still in a good mood at seven o'clock in the morning. No one got ticked off yet. No one got yelled at by their boss. There's very light traffic, so there's plenty of places to park. So yeah, we don't mind. The, we don't mind a seven a.m. start. So people are asking why, like, you aren't using gloves, and is the product gentle enough? This product is definitely is gentle enough, and Michelle's just built of steel. I am. She's from Ohio. Hands of steel. They're different out there in Ohio. They make them different in Ohio. They grow us up real good. They grow up real good now for once in a while. At yep. No, it's it's a very very fast process, and no, it's not. It, it, the color itself is it's not that impressive. Thing, so for this technique, so you're using two different colored toners. What colors? The one color is a cream, like butter, like a basically color of butter. The other one we like to call icy. It's going to ice it out, make it as neutral, pale yellow as possible. It's going to have a golden look and going to have a very neutral look. I put that neutral right up front, like the sun's like just beating the heck out of it because she is going on vacation. Mode. Vacation. Yes. By the way, you're going on vacation, right? Going on vacation. Thought, yes. Blah blah blah. <laughs> going on vacation. Okay, I got you, Ronnie. Just got a few minutes. You're good to go. Yeah, that was fun with Mike. I surprised the heck out of him. I'm sure he's going to get a lot of. Uh, flag from his crew. Mike was actually a, a former uh, post officer, uh, post postal worker. Post officer? Post, post officer? <laughs> he was a big guy. I think he was the, um, well, easy now. I think he was the, uh, the guy that ran the joint. Postmaster. Postmaster, that's, that's what, that's what that's it's called. Okay, so I from Amber Anderson, kind of a long one. Go ahead. I've been watching the whole time and have loved everything, but dude just said, no matter how long the lightener has been on here, it's not going to, not going to do any damage whatsoever. Can we get some clarification on that statement? He means additional damage, right? Because anytime we do anything on the hair that opens the cuticle or breaks the bond damage or cures, if the 28 or 30 volume lightener on top of color, damage is occurring, occurring to the hair. There's damage occurring, but when you're using a bond and flex, when you use one of the bond flexes, like we use our four bond, it's actually creating those uh, keratin proteins and saving those keratin proteins in the head rather than getting oxidized. So and let's, 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 let's be honest too. You start with, mm, you're going to end with, mm. you start with something bad, you're going to end with something bad. Nothing makes anything better. A little better, maybe like a standalone treatment, maybe, but it's not going to be virgin. But you know, let's use common sense, you know. If it's pretty messed up beforehand, you might want to think twice about using 30 volume on it. Okay? So wise judgment. There's an exception to every rule, and that's basically life. There's an exception to every rule. We don't start with 30 volume on the bottom either. No, we, we don't start, start with 30 down there. We'll start with 20 down there, 20, 25. And then as we go through, we'll increase. Everything comes up at the same time. Thank you, Michelle. You're welcome. Very good. <laughs> <laughs> what color line are you using? I, I'm, at this point, I'm not going to want to share that and say... Um, it's an imported line. I get. I, I know a guy that gets me this special color. So, just saying. Can you please ask about blue shampoos and if he likes them? About who shampoos? I'm sorry. Blue shampoos. Oh, blue and shampoo. Um, I'm a big fan of blue shampoo. Um, Dennis does not actually carry one, but what I do do. Oh yeah, true that. What I do do. What I do do. What I do do. <laughs> we use the color color balance corrector. This is actually a blue indigo dye, okay? We add this to our lighteners, 
We add this to, if, uh, for, for controlling warmth, we add it to, come on over here. We add it to our browns to keep our browns cool from going over. But I, I sometimes I'll retail this to the client and I'll tell them to put a couple drops in their shampoos or their conditioners. And, okay. And it acts it's just like a blue shampoo. Hmm. Uh, yes, it's pretty cool stuff. But we use it in our lighteners. Great, now I've got blue fingers. Um, <laughs> See what I mean? It really works well. <laughs> it's like a, I feel like I feel like a, I feel like an oyster. I'm a blue point. Blue point oysters. Um, you know, very very effective. Very very effective. That's what we do. With, I, I do retail that to clients, and yeah, I tell them you know start with this many drops and increase it if you need to. But anytime we're looking to control warmth, CBC, the color balance corrector, that's where we go. It does a mighty fine job. Mighty mighty fine job. Michelle's secret formula for this. Um, maybe it says right here when shampooing I know it's really really tiny but when shampooing pour shampoo on the palm of my hand four or five drops of CBC okay and that's good for a start and you make more, more on a dollar back a little bit less but it's very very effective this way you can use your same shampoo that you love without having to use a blue shampoo hope that answers your question <laughs> Michelle's magic number for this when she's bleaching or highlighting with bleach her magic number is 17 17 drops that's her magic number after years of deducing what the magic number should be. 17. No more, no less. How many? 17. 17. Thank you. <laughs> no more, no less. And believe me, if you're ripping up color for Michelle, it better be 17. Don't be screwing around. 17, that's it. Or else uh, I got to hear it when again? I get home. Did you like that, my blue finger? Did you like that? Can't believe it, right? Nice. It's pretty powerful. I'm just saying, it's pretty powerful stuff. I'm getting ready to rinse and condition. Okay. I did the shampoo already. All right. So let me talk about this real quick. So the latest, the latest offering from Dennis Bernard and Smart Solutions, in addition to the four Bond and Plex um, complex, Dennis has come out with, oh, this stuff blows my mind. I did a whole video on this earlier. Oh, the heavy guns, the heavy guns right? The guns are in the house. <laughs> this is the four bond and plex shampoo and conditioner this will support what you did with the four bond and plex chemical additive now this is really cool damaged hair ready for this this is cool get your thinking caps on damaged hair has a negative ionic charge okay a negative ionic charge All right the four bond and plex shampoo and conditioners with its proprietary blend of quinoa protein and baobab extract, baobab, baobab, it's all about that bay, about that bay, about that baobab. Anyway, with this skin extracts and baobab uh, extracts is positively charged. It's positively charged. So what we're saying is it magnetizes itself to the hair. It's a negative charge and a positive charge. It magnetizes, magnetizes to the hair. It's not coming off. It's not laying on the surface. It's magnetizing itself to the hair. This is why you only use it once every three shampoos. My son's blowing up over there. This is why we only recommend you use it every three shampoos because it will build up and it will have a negative impact, okay? So, this it's one of a kind, ain't nothing else like it. Ain't nothing else like it. This stuff, you got some damage here. Clients come in, they can't believe it. They love this stuff. I. It's a premium product, okay? This one's a little more on the premium side. I told they, Debbie she's getting that. The, the name of them. The name is right there. Four Bond and Plex. Four Bond and Plex Bond Building Shampoo. Bond Building Conditioner by Dennis Bernard and Power Tools. And you can see, it is, it's it's a little pricey. It's up there $23 a head. 23 for this one, 23 for that one. But you're only using it every three days and the first time the client uses it, the client will love it. Should you have this in your salon? And the clients, yeah, it's 23 bucks, I just don't know. Here's what we do, we, at these, uh, we go to the restaurant store and get these little containers like you use for like a tartar sauce container, you know, or like a dipping container. My son's grabbing one right now. And we will actually, and we do this with a lot of products, not just fourplex. We'll do this with a lot of different shampoos, conditioner. gels, condi oh, conditioner, I'm sorry. Oh, wait a minute, hold on, hold on. Uh, I don't want to drip all over. Let me use my, my, oh, uh, yeah. Uh, high five. Ha! <laughs> <laughs> we'll take, there you go, we'll take these little um, cups like this. We get them at the restaurant store, and we'll put anything in. We'll put this stuff in, and we'll put gels, we'll put paste, we'll put waxes. People just don't know, and no one's really making samples anymore. No one's making the one-ounce foil pack anymore. It's a lot of dough to make those. 
So you get those, send it home, guaranteed they're coming back. Guaranteed. You know what? I love that stuff. It was great. Give me a bunch of it. So great retail. It's a great retail idea. You know, we need to retail. You need to support your products and support the work you did at the salon. And sometimes clients are just, yeah, I don't know. I don't know. Send them home with it that way. They should be coming back. How are we doing on time here, V? Got a couple more minutes. Okay, a couple more minutes here. I have some questions. Go ahead, shoot. So just to be um, clarify things, she uses 17 drops CBC to her lightness to yep. cancel warm tones. How yeah. much lightener is used with the 17 drops? How much lightener are you using? Like, well, 33. Uh, it's um, 30. It's total 60 milliliters. Okay. So it's product plus. Uh, uh, Developer. Product plus developer, thank you. Okay. Just a little bit more. Go like more. three minutes. Let me see right here. Size that's great. That's size great. Size 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 that top. Tell you what, um, grab a jar. We're just going to bring this top just, just a wee bit more. Let me see what it looks like here. See what you got. Chisel that gray away. Oh, just, uh, you know, just a little bit, Vince. Just a little high heat, real quick. 30 seconds. Should pop right up. High heat? Yeah, we'll just bring it up. Yeah, it's going to pop right up. Just a couple Good. seconds. I have a question about TCA. Go ahead. Do you have to up your volume on your developer? No. Using you do not. You do not have to up all your, all your, your, your weight from the dryer. No. Anything, whether you're using four bond and plex or TCA, no. That's the beautiful thing about it. Keep your, keep your, um. <laughs> my station? No. Go ahead. Keep your, uh, your measurements. Keep your measurements the same as they always are. Don't worry, the beautiful in there she goes. Keep your measurements the same. That's the great, that's the big I love about this. I hate, because I, I mean, a couple of the other plexes and things like that, I'm just not crazy about bumping up my development. I'm just not, it's not crazy about it. I like to keep things the same. And that's what I love when they came out with the product and, and the TCA also. Uh -huh. Great question though, awesome question. So and do you remember um, Amber Anderson with that long, that one question about the different volumes? Yeah, 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 yeah. So, but what was I asking for is a clarification. Does the bonding agent altogether prevent damage when using color or lightener? Or does it prevent the additional damage that would occur when using a high volume peroxide and a lightener and leaving the product on for longer than the required time to lift the hair? Good question. Um, that is very subjective. Very subjective question, depending what's going on. Um, to be honest with you, when I've worked with it, I'm always amazed the quality of the hair when I'm done. When I'm using I'm using 30 volumes. I don't use four, I don't use 40 volume in anything. I don't use 40 volume in anything. 30 volumes, now I'm always amazed at how great the hair looks. But again, it's very subjective. Know what you got going on, but great, great, great question. I'm gonna go help Vince over here take these bad boys out. Bam! That's what I'm talking about. Look at that. Look at that. We got tensile strength. No problem. Strength's all, everything's there. No, no stretching, no nothing. Hi, -o. <laughs> Four bonding plex. Gets her done. Super. Okay? Yep. All right, right on. Have people watching from Central California. Central, what, what are they doing up already? What are you guys doing, what are you guys doing up? What are you kidding me? Impressive. That's some hardcore right there. <laughs> Go, Cali. Go, Cali. Four hours, man. I'm, holy smokes. <laughs> Nothing personal. I didn't think California got started before one o'clock in the afternoon. <laughs> I remember I was watching a... Um, I had a, I had a laugh. I had a laugh. I was watching um, Larissa Doll, Larissa Love, you know, and um, <laughs> she just got a a couple months ago, and she's coming in the new salon, and, um, and she got into Starbucks in one hand, and she has. We're getting started early today. It's uh, quarter to ten. <laughs> quarter to ten. I got six people out the door by quarter to ten, but I'm an early guy. That's why. I'm sure she probably works till eleven o'clock at night too, but. Yeah, we, we, we're East Coast. We got a lot of grit out here. But holla back at you, Callie. Right on. People from Wyoming. From Wyoming. Nebraska. Yeah, Nebraska in the house. <laughs> Welcome, guys. The sun's still rising. Louisiana. Louisiana. <laughs> right on. That's great. Great to hear Colorado. from y'all. <laughs> Colorado. It's 420 somewhere. Yeah. Georgia. There you go. Yeah. 
<laughs> Georgia, <laughs> Georgia. Vermont. All right. Yeah, everybody, welcome, welcome, welcome. We're gonna show you. Okay, so we're gonna be show you, showing you a um. We got one more special trick to do with Deb here. It's a very, very special trick. She's looking forward to it. I get another trick. You get another trick, yeah. This one's a clay. You'll love this one. If you thought the hammer and chisel was good, where do you see this one? I can't wait. <laughs> I'm shaking. I gotta take it easy because Deb's my neighbor. I gotta live next to this young lady. Mm. She's gonna give me the evil eye from the kitchen window. <laughs> They're jumping in the pool in the middle of the night. Right, Vicky asked, how yeah. do you get the hair to live properly if you don't use a higher level peroxide? I never had luck with that raising the de developer. Yeah, um, I'll tell you what, you gotta take thin sections. That's my key. If I want something to really blow through the roof, man, I mean, I gotta have like minimal amounts of hair in that foil so it really breaks through. That's a little secret too. Sometimes it's not chemical, it's physical too. So you gotta combine both of them. But you want that hair to blow through really, really fine. Might put more foils in, but less hair. Uh, it's easier for the, the lightener to break through and conquer. Mm -hmm. Another great question, a great question, right on. Lots of variables, you know. A lot of variables. Now Vince is, you know, Vince is a chemistry major, so he can tell you all about variables. Right? <laughs> What I want to know is how did I, how did I, as the owner of the shop, get, how was I going to put my own stuff away? Don't turn up to hire somebody to do this for me. <laughs> Humility, it's overrated. <laughs> how are we doing, Diesel? I'm going to get your stuff ready. Don't go anywhere. I'll be right back. All right. I'm doing some hair over here. Yeah. Leave it like that. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. <laughs> because I know it's very, very conditioning. And put a lot of shine on the hair. TCA is a combination of, let me see if I memorize it. Vitamin E, jojoba oil, tocopherol, acetate, and I think olive oil? Yes, olive oil, and mineral oil and olive oil, there you go. And vitamin E, which I think is tocopherol, acetate. <laughs> These are big words for first thing on a Monday morning, aren't they? Any recommendations about going from medium brown to all over gray? Oh, yeah. Give yourself about six months. Oh, <laughs> tell me that. <laughs> and you're on six percent. You mean? I mean ten percent. What's that? Ten percent. Your battery. Oh, um, oh. Well, hold on a second. Let me plug you <laughs> in. Yeah, two medium brown going to gray. You know, that just, it's not going to happen in one session. Hang on there. Let me let me get plugged in. You going to plug in there, babe? Yeah. It's not going to happen in one session. We all know that. It's going to be multiple sessions. And again, I highly, highly, highly recommend strand test, strand test, strand test. Just go, go right in. You know, there's a lot of the stuff on the, oh, uh, you know, we see it on Facebook. We see it on Instagram, the before and afters. And, oh. Uh, yeah, what you don't know is it took them six. It took them six sessions. You know, it took them a while to get there. Um, strand test. Can't say it enough. <laughs> the Facebook page is Seagrove Lancaster Hair Port, correct? What's that? I'm sorry. The Facebook page is yeah. Seagrove Lancaster. Seagrove. It's just Seagrove Hair Port. Seagrove Hair Port. No, not yet. You stay there. I'm getting a new town paper. Oh, okay. Yeah, Seagrove Hair. I think it's Seagrove Hair Port. Yeah, that'll get it done. How are we doing there, right? Okay, we good? Don't want to run out of power. It's the last, oh my goodness, it's the last couple exciting moments going on here. Okay, so.
Now look at that, we use that barrier look and there's nothing on her head. Isn't that great? We'll have to go back a little bit. There's a little, a little bit. A little different. bit there, but it's gonna come right off anyway. We'll do I think that's from the facelift. <laughs> from the facelift. <laughs> we usually, we usually get to that when the, uh, the when the conditioner's sitting in there for a couple minutes. I'm busy. I'm busy right now. I'm very, very busy right now. <laughs> we still, still loading? Mm -hmm. uh, okay, good. All right, now. Good, ready? <clears throat> okay, all right, all right. Okay, let me go over here and do this. All right. Vince, what, Vince, what are you doing, Vince? I just can't level out this porosity. Are you trying to balance the porosity and level it out? I am trying to. It just, it's just not working, man. Vince, I, I don't know if a level is the way to go. What do you mean? You got to forget those hand tools, and you got to get yourself some power tools. Oh, that's what I'm talking about. <laughs> You can use tools, but you can use power tools. That's what I'm this is the about. color filler insurance. This is what we use to equalize our porosity. I couldn't wait to do that. I've been waiting an hour to do that. This is a, uh, it's essentially a hydrolyzed wheat protein. Oh, this is going to even out the, even out the porosity, give the hair, and make everything make take it. Blah, 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 blah. Let the hair take the color evenly. Okay. I also, cool, cool. You're ready to go here. I also use this. This is very important. Hey, let's go back to perms. If I oh that looks we'll be we'll be out there shortly. Don't I'm, you go I'm, anywhere. I'm liking Isn't that, that gorgeous? Yeah. Holy cow! Um, color if you're perming color treated hair, this is very important. Or you know anything has got highlights or whatever. I highly recommend and Power Tools highly recommends you clarify the hair with clarifying shampoo. You bring them out, you towel dry, you spray a very generous amount of CFI into the wet head, comb it, get it in there, put them under a hood dryer till that hair is bone dry. Basically, it's like putting your hair on steroids. So that color treated hair is gonna, is gonna give you the best fight on taking a perm and taking it properly without extensive damage, okay? So CFI, definitely, if you're doing color treated hair, don't even think about going in there unless you got the color filler insurance. Okay, that's right. No hammers or level required with this one. You like that one, didn't you? I like that you one. like that one. I do. I know. I have a question <laughs> from Vicky. Go ahead, Vic. I'm sorry to ask this question earlier. Go ahead. Or add this to my question. Sorry. How do you okay. get the hair to lift properly when using a bond builder and not using the level of developer? What was that again? I'm sorry. All right. How do you get the hair to lift properly when using a bond builder and not raising the level of developer? Bond Bill, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I was, I was distracted for a moment. <laughs> How do you get the hair to lift properly? How do you get the hair to lift properly when using a bond builder and not raising the level of development? It's just that's how it's designed. That's just how it's designed. That that's the most beautiful part about four bond flex complex. That's the beauty of it. It's designed that way. Well, there, said there it. You go. Said it. Men, can um, represent it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Do a color. Do a color. Stop and go, man. Stop and go. Do a color and stuff. No worries. No worries. No worries. I get it. Don't color. Okay. Mm. Pack it in there. I'll get a brush too. Why not? Why not? We'll get two brushes in there. Here we go. Again, this is the same type of color uh, Michelle just got done using. So, you know, no gloves required. These old leather hands can handle it. My sensitive hands. Vince is still young yet. He's he's got baby hands. <laughs> Life hasn't touched him as hard as the rest of us. <laughs> What's the name of your bond builder again? Four bond and plex. Number four bond and plex. Or some people just go by four bond. Four bonds ago, I think they're doing just four bond now. A little identity crisis, but it's all good now. Okay. Did you get the front up there? Front done. Did you get that front up there. Okay. Get that front up there. There we go. And again, we're not just doing two people and one person because it's this is Monday and we're doing this Facebook live. We do this, this all the time. Every day. Every day. Twenty four seven. Twenty six five. Except for the days when we're off. Somebody standing still, jump in and help. Just jump in and help. Teamwork. You know it's kind of wild. I th I thought this was the way it was at every salon, <laughs> but apparently not. It's, I'm thinking, you know, someone needs a hand, jump in and help out, but 
Really? Freezing them for five minutes, no heat. Five minutes, no heat. But apparently, it's, it's not like that all over the planet. We're one of the few. But I think it's a great way to work. It keeps it keeps uh, it keeps it fun. A client gets a lot of it too. I mean, what client doesn't want like four, six pair of hands on? Give me that. Feel like a princess, so for God's sake. I feel like a queen. <laughs> right on. Let's, yeah, here. let's let's go here. Let's let's go over and take a look. I got you. I'll follow you. <laughs> Oh, look at this. Look at that. Hello. 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 Beautiful, Michelle. Thank you, thank you. You see where the, the neutral, the little bright stuff is? Then you see the butter right behind it. All throughout. This beautiful blonde tone on tone. That is stunning. Now look at the health of that hair. There's no, there's no flat iron in there. It's just a blow dry. Perfect, absolutely perfect. And Michelle did use, when she finished, she did spray in the four bond leave-in treatment. So this is like, instead of the other plexes and bonders that you put the conditioner in, leave it for 15 minutes and da 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 you just spray it in, you leave it in. This is not a go-home product, okay? Spray it in, leave it in, good to go. Finish, finish with FHS? Feel like finish with FHS? FHS! Flexible holding spray. Love me some flexible holding spray. That's gorgeous, Lynn. Just beautiful. Vacation hair. Vacation hair. Right one. Say. Right on. <laughs> and then there was more. Welcome to me. Oh. You are very nice. Hey. Beautiful. Thank okay. you for coming. Mm -hmm. Thank you for coming. Mm -hmm. Right on, right on, right on. What color here. toner do you consider butter color? Uh, cream. 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 Uh, cream and icy. Yeah, icy and cream. Ashy and not so ashy. Yeah, ashy and not so ashy. There you go. That's a good combo. How are we doing here, Vic? What do we got left? Okay. So... We got we got these we got these airwaves till twelve o'clock, so we're gonna come out of here and we're gonna get the Seagro triple play going on. Oh, 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 oh the Seagro, oh. You ain't seen nothing until you see the Seagro triple play. I can't wait. <laughs> I'm on the edge of my pants. You should be on the edge of your seat, I I'm telling you. <laughs> this is something that I did a, a couple years ago, I did a a video for Dennis and we were at a location in Langhorn and I had this really thick head of hair and we had to really get in and get out so um, they wanted to go I was time to blow dry and they wanted to go just right to the next person and, and do their video and I said no 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 I, said, I gotta get out of here hang on a second <laughs> so I had my blow dryer and we were in a salon there and I had Vince grab a dryer from somewhere, and Michelle grabbed another dryer from somewhere, and the three of us go in oh, and just start speed drying. We're done in like five minutes, you know. And the funny thing was, the funny thing was, there was other staff there from the dryer. And all, stay right there. There was other staff there. And all of a sudden, you see these heads peek out like, what are they doing? I've never seen three people blow dry before. What? It's called teamwork, man. It's called teamwork. We do a lot of teamwork here. The wind channel effect. <laughs> the, right? Yes, yeah, absolutely. Like sending me to the car wash? Absolutely. <laughs> Chenzo, how are we doing? We're good to go. Good to go. When you say butter, are you talking gold tones? Yep. Yeah, gold, but not overly gold, like not orange. Yeah. What yep. shampoo is best for fly away gray hair? Yeah. Fly away gray hair? I'll tell you what I like. Go ahead, Vince. I'll tell you what I really like. Good. Okay. Um, I will, and I, to a lot of my clients, I recommend this too. I like going in with the Dennis Bernard dual action shampoo, followed by the dual action conditioner. Okay, but even this, even the shampoo itself is great. But let me tell you a little secret. Let me just grab something real quick because I retail this a lot. She might be with Gregor. I'll be right back. Then some of the answer is. Can you update what base color for retouch that your client is? What's the color? What's our base retouch color here? Our base retouch here was a level seven gold. Level seven? Level seven gold, yes. 
So uh, as we were talking about flyaway gray, speaking of flyaway gray, speaking of flyaway gray, gray the, uh, I love the Smart Solutions Color Protector Conditioner and Styling Aid. It's like there's nothing this stuff doesn't do. First thing it does, um, it's a very, very light styler, very light, but if you continue to use this on really coarse gray, the gray actually gets softer. Actually gets a little softer. Like even after a couple months of use, every day, use it every day, it actually gets a little softer. It's absolutely fabulous. Works really, really well. At Flyway, same thing. It just kind of softens the hair a little bit. Does really, really, really nice. Wonderful product. Okay, Vince's, there we go, right there. So it does, and it extends the color life. Uh, if you have color in your hair, it actually stops the oxidation process. It's pretty cool, I know. Very, very cool. You know what, I didn't do that on mic. Ah, I forgot to do a step on mic. I wanted to spray the PCS, the product conditioner and styling aid in his hair, because that also neutralizes the neutralizer that's in his head, that leftover neutralizer. Oh, darn, I knew I forgot something. Oh, well. Yeah. Next time. It have next time, this right? Here for Definitely. <laughs> okay. I'm gonna grab a towel and get the PCS. That's fine. All right, this looks just absolutely beautiful. Just stunning. Vince is grabbing some um, color stain remover. He's just gonna get whatever residual is there. Get that out of the way. Deb's got a huge weekend coming up. Gonna be seen by a lot of people. <laughs> probably, the... probably her picture <clears throat> taken too. She'll be in celluloid forever. What do you got? I hope not. What are the retail prices for those products? For those pro for uh, this one here, let me see. He is, he is, he is, looks like he didn't get labeled. <laughs> <laughs> He's 14. This one here is 14. Um, we, uh, let me think. The take home sizes are for the shampoo and conditioner are. I believe 12 and 14, respectively. I believe they're 12 and 14. Yeah, 12 and 5, I believe so, 12 and 14. The, the, the Smart Solutions line is a great line. It's a very high performance line. But like I said a, a while ago, they invest the money inside the bottle. No, no, so there's no cute gold caps, there's no you know, designer, it's, it's a bottle. It's what's inside the bottle that makes it work. So very, very moderately priced. Uh, fits into any budget. It really, really does. And all the products are very concentrated, so they go a long way. And by the way, they're all sulfate-free, too. So, you know, it don't really suds up a lot. My thing is always <clears throat> less less shampoo, more water. Move it around. All right, we're out of here. All right. All right. We're set up. We got till 12 o'clock, so let's try to get this baby done. Oh, we got this. <laughs> I can't wait to see this part. This part, this part, oh, this part is going to be great. In fact, let me, I'm going to get everybody set up. It's the grand I have, finale. I have, I have a feeling it it's going to be a wonderful finale. experience. I know. I just want to joke it. Okay, we're going to go to the house. I figured it out. Okay, we're going to go to the house. Thank you. Thanks, guys. Thank you so much. <laughs> That's fine. All right, so we're getting ready here for the Seagro Triple Play. We're going to get in position. Are we ready? Let's go. Everybody, man your posts. Here we go. Here we go. Where are you going? Where do you want to Take position. I'll block while you start. You block. <laughs> we got till 12. We're going to get her done. Kurt, the clock. Oh, yeah, back here. We'll be blowing down the street here in a minute. <laughs> blowing. Uh, Want to grab um, 35. Grab me some four bond real quick. Four bond. Oh, Sorry. Whoops. I got it. The shell's on it. My gold brush up. Right in the rain. Okay. Oh, the gray is all gone. Gray be oh. gone. Gray be gone. <laughs> bad gray. Bad gray. No no chisel needed, see? <laughs> Why well, use hand tools and you have power tools? Right. That's right. Okay, so this is the this is sec this is part two of four bond. Look, happens instantly. Doesn't take all day. Just like that. Just spray it in. 
Let it rip. I'm gonna go in with so I'm gonna go in with my Smart Solutions age defying age defying vitamin oil. This is our version of argon oil. Okay, eliminates frizz. This that and the other thing. Don't need a lot. I'm, that's like plenty right there. That is more than plenty. All right, let's get her all in there. I love the smell. Does that smell like butterscotch? Oh, it's like, like butterscotch. It's it. like little like those know, rocks like, like butterscotch used to give it to kids, you know? I want it all over. <laughs> Do they make cream for the body? You can actually you throw can it actually, in your wash. You can actually throw, wash. Yeah, you can throw it in your body wash. Yeah. Oh, it's wow. just an oil, yeah. you know, with some dimethic kind of stuff. And, Fabulous. Oh, it's great stuff. Wonderful stuff. Oh, yeah. Okay. All right, here we go. Let's get in position here. Uh-oh. <laughs> here we go. This is a dangerous part. I know blood drying doesn't sound like a lot of fun, mm -hmm. so if anybody has any questions they want to ask or any comments they want to make, or Better do it now. that'd be great. And like I said, we're, 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 they're pulling the plug on us at 12, so we're going to try to get this done. Here we go. Woo! Secret Oak Triple Play. Woo! Oh, yeah! Here we go. Michelle's the odd one out. She has to have a white drawer. I like to be my own person. She's special. She has to be her own person. That's my angelic man. Don't you like the white capes? So angelic. Now, our client's hair is very, very curly. Very, very curly. Very, very. Oh, nice. Beautiful. I, I sampled her some from her she's Oh, great. Yeah, Smart uh, Solutions also has a line of curl, uh, curl nourishing shampoo, conditioner, and a creme. And really, really nice. Apparently, all hair types like it. Not uh, Whether it's fine hair, regular hair, medium hair, coarse hair even likes it. Does a great job. It's fortified with the quinoa protein. You know, quinoa, not just for losing weight anymore. It's a great humectant. And we sell a lot of that. As you can see, we just put an order in because all that stuff should be right there on the top. But there's just a um, just a tube of shampoo left. Apparently we gotta re-up. We sold a lot of it last week. All right, here we go. How we go? And like I said, this is not unusual. We do this all the time. Nice color. Thank you. Yeah, great color day. This reminds me of like remember the old days you had like a Polaroid. I'm impressed. <laughs> <laughs> so you'd be, not, I the, am. not the first time we've done this, Dan. <laughs> like a ballet. I should bring my Polaroid and then take a photo of all What's of us that? doing it. What's that? I should, I should bring my Polaroid and take a photo of all of us doing it and I'll print out yeah. one. <laughs> you have a Polaroid? Yeah. Really? Like, like the land camera? It's a mini yeah. one. It's a, okay. So I have like mini right. pictures. Mini film. Right on. Here. Yeah, that's it. A lot of people have those. Okay. Like newer ones. Let's keep it going. I'm gonna fire up a flat iron real quick. Actually, nah, come on. Fire it up. Fire that baby up. <laughs> fire that baby up. Had a great time today with everyone. Thanks everyone for tuning in. Just in California, getting up early. Big California. Go so figure. Maybe they were just still up from last night. Because <laughs> <laughs> it is our day off, you know. Sunny's a Sunny's a weird day to be, to be a hairdresser and going out, but nothing's going on. Not usually. Yeah. Not in Lancaster, not too much. Awesome. 
Right in there. Yeah, buddy. Buttery. Yeah, buddy. Buttery. Buttery. <laughs> Actually, you were champagne. Woo. Yes. I want the finest. Got that back beat? What's that? No, no, you so got. Good. Yeah. Awesome. Coming down the wire. And then number two. <laughs> and then number two. And then number two. This is my great view, Lex. Good view outside. This is where I look at every single day. Got a great view. You'd be amazed that some people will walk by some days. It's a riot. The windows are mirrors. Yeah, out front the windows are mirrors, and sometimes people check out the look in the mirror. If you go to our oh yeah, if you go to our um, our website or our Facebook, you'll oh you'll see pictures of us taking pictures of people <laughs> looking in the mirror. Oh, it's a hoot. Beautiful. Okay, Michelle, when I flat on, could you go on FHS duty? You got it. Right on. Cool. Now what we like to do here, Michelle's gonna break out FHS the flexible holding spray. I'm gonna use that before my uh <laughs> Did you want to do that again, Michelle? I will. Okay. Listen. <laughs> We're gonna use that. Before our, um, before we put the iron in. Okay, give me a hit. Yeah, give me a hit, Michelle. Right on. And yes, it's going to send it over. I'm working at, uh, I'm working at three, I should be working at 370, not 390. Thank you. Okay, get that out of the way. Here we go. That's your protection stuff. Yes, yes. Heat protection. Yeah. There we go. Beautiful. There we go. Looking great, looking great, looking great. Beautiful. Look at how healthy, look how shiny that is. Just fabulous, fabulous, fabulous. Does anybody have any more questions? Anybody questions? We're going to be closing it out here soon. Questions or comments? Concerns? There is a, a question by Cynthia. Go ahead, Cynthia. What do you got? Is it okay to leave the color on longer because of doing color clients back to back when you use TC, TCS to shorten, probably mean TCA, to shorten the processing time? Is it, one more time. I, I, Sorry. I, yeah, I lost. Is it okay oh. to leave the color on longer, longer because of doing color? Oh, yeah, 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 no problem. That's back fine. Back. That's fine, yeah. I mean, color molecules only developed so far, you know. They've come a long way since the early days. Of, yeah, you leave it on longer. That's, that's no biggie. No biggie at all. It's been done. Let's just put it this way. It's been done. Usually that's when I'm running behind and i got to get on somebody else and I'll say something like, yeah, we're doing this new thing where we leave the color on a little longer. You know. <laughs> Of course, the client comes in next time and goes, "Why don't you leave that color on longer?" And but they, by then they yeah. figured it out. I was just, you know, smoke screening them. <laughs> we know what we do in this business. Come on, everybody's got their little tricks. That's great. There's that baby light right there, looking really, really I like nice. That little light. I, I know you like that little baby light. That's oh, it's nice so light. cute. That's isn't a nice it? light. <laughs> oh my goodness, so cute, little baby light. What's yes. the brand name of the blue drops? Uh, that's Power Tools by Dennis Bernard. CBC, Color Balance Corrector. Yep, Color Balance Corrector, CBC by... By the big bottle. Come on, that's, right, they, that's right, they sell a, I forgot, they make a four ounce bottle now, that's right. It was usually just a two ounce bottle. We go through that on Saturday morning. Excellent, okay. 
All right, just got a little bit more to do, gang. Just a little bit more. In the meantime, I'm going to start my send off. And I'd like to thank everyone today for chiming in with questions and comments. And hopefully we can help you all out as we help each other out. I tried to answer the questions as best as I could. Um, I'd like to thank the folks at Salon Centric for giving me this opportunity. I really, really enjoy being, I really enjoy doing the Facebook Lives and I really, really enjoy sharing information. Can't share enough information. But again, I want to thank, uh, I think it's Ryan for setting us all up on the Facebook Live and hopefully maybe we'll do this again sometime with something. Had a really good time. Folks over at Dennis Bernard Incorporated. Dennis, thank you so much. Hey. <laughs> Eric and Joe and Jeff and Mario, good luck down there in Florida. Looks like he's doing his thing and everyone that makes it possible there. Thank you again and thank you again for the great products that have made my career and our, what we put out, our product look so fabulous and, and great. And keep up the good work. Always looking forward to something new coming out. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, Deb's down, Deb's got this. She's all down. All right. Eric, I know you're in a meeting and I hope on the ride home you have a couple good laughs and I'm sure, uh, I'm sure we'll be the, I'm sure we'll be talked about the water cooler tomorrow, I'm pretty sure. <laughs> Having a good, good time. All right, let's finish up. Oh, man, it's running against the clock here. Can you do it? You can do it. You can do it. I know we can do it. I know we can do it. All right, let's take bets. The pyramid. What? What's that? Nine minutes. Not. We got nine minutes. Yeah. Oh, I can slow down. I can slow down. Okay. You do a whole other set. I didn't even throw any jokes in today. Poor folks don't even know I tell great jokes. Jeez. Poor things. Maybe that's a good thing. Whatever. I like telling jokes. Yeah, my poor staff, I tell these jokes, I'll tell them for weeks at a time. God, look at you. I tell them for weeks at a time. I think by, you know, 12 o'clock during the week, my uh, staff is tired of my stupid jokes. Yeah. Yeah. They're saying them in their sleep? Are you no, saying I think, that I, think there's lot, I think there's a lot of eye rolling going on. Oh, God, here it goes again. Oh, I got to lose it again. Yeah. <laughs> I hope everybody liked the uh, hammer and chisel move we did today. Uh, my son and I were brainstorming when we got this assignment on some funny things we could do. And the level, the, le the whole level thing just occurred to me last Friday about leveling out the prostate hair. I thought that was hysterical. Tell, um, tell Dara, Borbon, and TCR all the Dennis Bernard products. Tell who? Dara. Dara Pinto McHenry. Hey, Dara. All CBC and Borbon, Borbon TCA. TCA, all that's all Dennis Bernard products. Angela Davis wants to know what iron you're using. This, uh, this is your standard babyless titanium. I was going to get there, Vince. Thank you. Oh. <laughs> Look, they're competing over questions. Quick, somebody fire one out. <laughs> this, is a, this, is, this, this nano titanium has been, he's definitely been used, that's for sure. He's got that longevity, though. He's got some long. Yeah, he does. He does. He, he served me pretty well. He served me pretty well. Okay, I do have one more move, though. Oh, we got nine, I got one more move. The one more move to do here. Ah, it's an old school move. It's old, it's so old school. Deb, you'll probably remember this one. He might have done this back in the day. I probably <laughs> invented it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, what a hoot. Okay, so let me grab um, let me grab my wet brush. Oh, oh yeah, you know I'm going there, so. Uh, what's the name of the heat protection? Heat protection, that's FHS. That's your flexible holding spray from Dennis Bernard and Smart Solutions. Okay, here's my final move. Again, I'm going to take my AVO, my age defying vitamin oil. Grand finale. Grand finale. Put a couple drops here. I'm going to take my wet brush or a boar's hair brush or whatever you want. Whatever you want. I'm going to take it. I'm going to put it in the bristle. All in the bristles. Old school move, man. This one's so, and here I go. And I'm going to go underneath, and I'm going to come right over top of it, and I'm going to get it in all the hair just like that. For the nice, super smooth, super shiny finish. Get some residual in there, absolutely. Get that health level going. That's what we're talking about right there. Ah, uh, yeah. Booyah. 
And that's I did that movie a little bit ago. I wish I could say I, was, I invented it, but I didn't. I stole it from someone else. <laughs> Because that's what we're in the business of. We're in the business of stealing stuff from each other all day long. This is incredible holding spray. This will stop a fly in flight. Oh, one of those. Yeah, one of those, yeah. I, love I do love you. Yeah, you know. You know. We like it stiff. Um, Vicky wants to know, can you recap the active products used and how to use them? Sure can. Here we go. From the top. TCA. From the top. TCA. The color, and, uh, the color accelerator. And also Lightner Accelerator also, okay? This goes in every formula we use. To stop uh, irritated scalps, STB, stop the burn. Okay, uh, it's a peppermint-based oil, and it is Christmas, just saying. Now stop the burn, CBC, the color balance corrector, that's your blue indigo dye in there to cancel out any un unwanted warmth. We have G-O-D, the gray oxidizing drops, that's gonna help penetrate any kind of resistant gray and assistance with TRA, the resistant assistant, uh, basically hydrolyzed ammonia. It's going to soften the, the gray hair before you get in there. Great for perms also. Great for softening up perms before you get in there. We use CFI, the color filler insurance. That's your hydrolyzed wheat protein. It's going to equal out the porosity in the hair. Uh, and then, of course, the color standing remover. We use this for a barrier before we start color, and we use it to remove color afterwards. In all our formulas, we did use the four bond implex, um, a uh, bomb molecular multiplier. We did put in the leave-in treatment afterwards, and we did use the age-defining age defining vitamin oil, which is the our, our argon oil, plus other essential oils in there. Incredible holding spray, flexible holding spray, and this is what I forgot to put in Mike's hair, my perm. I forgot to finish him with the protector, conditioner, and styling aid that actually neutralizes the neutralizer. And I'll do this again. I do it all the time. Neutralizer is basically H2O2. It's peroxide. What this does is it removes one oxygen. So now you have H2O, water. Yay. Great, great stuff. Great stuff. We're going to finish it up. We're going to wrap it up. Thank you again. Thank you, everyone out there, for hanging out with us. Thanks for the questions. Yay. See you down the road sometime. Mm -hmm. Thank, wait a minute. Ready? One, Yo. two, three. Thanks, Dennis. Squat